Yeah. Well, yeah, but, but I think it's Hi, my name is Paul Denisowski. I'm an Applications Engineer with Rodian Schwartz, and I'm here to talk to you today about our handheld portfolio of instruments for base station maintenance, installation, and troubleshooting. Uh, we have three instruments here. The first one is the FSH-8. It's a handheld spectrum analyzer. In addition to doing all the normal spectrum analysis functions, it can also work as a spectrum analyzer, a network analyzer for doing things such as sweeping filters, lines, amplifiers. It does digital modulation analysis, so it can be used to look at demodulated signals for LTE, WCDMA, CDMA 2K, and EVDO. We also have a distance default, and as well as a power meter measurement. So it's a general all-around, all-purpose instrument that can be used to troubleshoot base stations and uh, help maintain them and keep them to spec. The next instrument, which is similar in form factor but different in architecture and purpose, is the Pier 100. The Pier 100 is actually a monitoring receiver, not a spectrum analyzer. That means that it actually does a digital to analog conversion of a spectrum, does an FFT, and spits out the results. What this means essentially is that you see a much faster, much more detailed display. It allows you to troubleshoot problems with interference and also to monitor signals in near real time with a high degree of accuracy and obviously uh, very quick speed. It also has direction finding capability built into it, which allows you to, for example, do triangulation on signals based on the output of our HT300 directional antenna. The last instrument we have is the ZVH. The ZVH8 is a oh, network yeah. analyzer, so it has functions similar to what we saw in the FSH in terms of measuring filters, sweeping lines, distance default. It also has a ZVH wizard, which allows you to automate these tasks and have a single button press so that the technician in the field can simply run the test with a one touch of a button.